Dr. Donna. Welcome to week 45. Without further ado, let's get this party started. <laughs> I gotta be honest, it's fall and it's hunting season for a lot of people, but we don't wanna go chasing skinny rabbits. That was the title of last week's book. What is a skinny rabbit? I'm so glad you asked that question. Here's the definition. Dr. Trent also lists all the different types of skinny rabbits that are in the book. Woo-wee! Boy, oh boy, there are a lot out there. The best part of the book and the part that resonated the most with me was that there is a solution to stop chasing skinny rabbits, and that's to pursue the great stag. What is the great stag? I'm glad you asked. That definition is up next. So don't chase skinny rabbits, right? It's so simple. Not necessarily. Sometimes you end up on the rabbit trail without even realizing it. The goal is to recognize where you are and then immediately turn around, like I always say, and begin to focus back on the great stag. And that will ensure that everything you want to accomplish in life, in business, and your career is going to be possible. Last week's TED talk was lessons in business from prison. No, it actually was a good message. Basically, what the speaker said was that. We have to offer business opportunities to prisoners that are exiting the prison facility. Because if we don't, did you know that two out of three prisoners return to prison within three to five years if they don't have anything to do? There aren't any resources in the prison system while they're there, but when they exit out, there should be a way for them to transition into business. We don't want the recidivism rate to increase. We actually want it to decrease. Here in Las Vegas, we actually have an organization that actually helps prisoners to inculcate themselves back into society. And here's the information for that. This week's book, The Human Side of Change. Yes, I'm super excited about it. You know, I love change. I can't wait to see what they have to offer. This week's TED Talk, how to start a movement. Mm -hmm. We always wonder how things get going, and now we're gonna find out how to start a movement. It's gonna be pretty cool. This has been a thought-provoking week, and I like to say that when you can see it, and you can read it, then you can believe it, and you most certainly can achieve it. From here to the galaxy. I'll see you guys next week. Au revoir.